Hi, this is Tom Norris with the Lone Star Conference, coming to you from Bill Greedy Arena on the campus of St. Mary's University. Thanks for joining us today as we're here with head women's basketball coach Jason Martins, who's in his 14th season at the helm of the Rattlers, and senior Alexia Torres as part of the Lone Star Conference Basketball Online Media Day. Guys, thanks for joining us today. Coach Martins, we'll start with you. What are your expectations for the 2019-2020 women's basketball team? You know, I mean, the biggest thing is we just want to show up every day and get better. Um, we got a good group of, uh, you know, returners uh, coming back. Um, we have some players who are coming off injuries that are now healthy, um, along with some good freshmen and a couple transfers that are joining us as well. So, um, you know, we show up, get better every day. Um, love to see what we look like in March. So you talked a little bit about some injuries you're coming off of, 18 wins last year. What changes, improvements has your team made from last season to this season? You know, the biggest thing we're hoping for is an increase in depth. Um, last year with the injuries, um, depth really hurt us, especially late in the season. Um, this year, hopefully, we're um, able to go deeper into our bench, um, which will help us um, not only with our conditioning, with our energy level on the court, but hopefully uh, gets where we need to go in the postseason. Alexia, we'll get, we'll get to you next. Your senior season, uh, last night had your, your, your last first scrimmage of your career. What does that feel like? Uh, it was very overwhelming because I've been here for four years and basketball is the only sport I've ever played in my entire life. So it was a bit sad but exciting because I want to end off the season on a good note. And me being the only senior is very exciting because it's a good way to be a leader and set an example to everyone else. And I just want to be encouraging to everyone on and off the court. That being said, you open your season up in 12 days at UTEP on, on November 2nd. What's the vibe like in the locker room right now, getting ready to play that, that season opener? Um, everyone's super excited. Everyone's being super encouraging, positive with each other on and off the court. The locker room, we're just super close, all friends, all sisters. So it's going to be interesting to see how we carry that energy on the court. Coach Martin, we'll jump back to you. What did you learn about your team this offseason? Um, you know, they're working. Um, really feel like these uh, you know, young ladies, um, know how to work hard. Uh, I've learned to uh, bring it every single day and been really happy with, with, how, with how they're working. Um, you know, I know we got a good group of, like I said before, a mixture of returners and youth, and uh, I really love how our returners have taken their youth underneath their wings and helping them grow as players and uh, looking forward to seeing how that evolves throughout the season. You kind of touched on it there. Talk a little bit about this some key returners, and then some, some newcomers that you think are going to make an impact for this year? You know, it all starts with the person to my left here. You know, Alexia has been a, uh, uh, you know, a, you know, a player in our, consistent player in our program for the last three years, going into her senior year. Uh, definitely looking forward to her being solid at the point guard spot for us. Um, we return two other starters in Soteria Banks and Hannah Wilson. And uh, so with those three starters, I'm uh, really excited to see you know, the leadership that they've shown, um, you know, this fall. I'm um, looking forward to seeing what they can do on the court this, this winter. Lone Star preseason rankings just came out this week, or, or will come out next week, excuse me. Rattlers picked seventh in, in that poll. What are your thoughts on that? What, you know, what's your peers thought of you there? You know, um, it's probably, probably right on. Um, for what we lost last year, we lost three really good seniors. Um, and so by losing those three seniors, um, just they were our, our leaders last year. So, you know, you expect to take a little bit of a drop um, when the preseason poll comes out. But, um, but I like our mentality of our workout of our, of our players this year and definitely look forward to uh, trying to prove people wrong this year. First year in the Lone Star Conference, either one of you can answer this. What's the expectation? It's obviously one of the tougher leagues in the, in the country. Talk about your expectations and the excitement about playing that big division. I'll let you go first and I'll follow up. Um, I guess the expectation is coming into this new conference is it doesn't matter who we're playing. I think we just all need to just go out there and play our hardest, go 100%, uh, 110% like every single time we go on the court. So it doesn't really matter who we're playing. We played some of these teams last year in non-conference games, so it's not going to be anything new. It's just going to be playing those teams more and playing them twice, playing them here at home and just different environment. You know, I just want to echo, you know, what Alexia said, you know, we've played these teams um, in the past, um, and so we just look forward to, you know, continue to play them um, now on a more larger scale. 
Um, not that they didn't mean anything last year, but now they mean, you know, everything as far as it goes to a conference championship. And, you know, it's going to be a battle night in, night out. Um, 18 teams in the conference. Um, just you got the defending national champion in your conference. Um, so it's just going to be knockout, drag out battles every single night. And um, we're getting ourselves prepared for it every day. Lexi, you've now been practicing officially for a week. What's impressed you most about this year's team and how you practice? Um, I just think that what Coach Myers had said, that our mentality has been there. So we started off the very first day a little bit rocky, but I'm really impressed on how we bounced back from that. And every single day since then has been really good. And I feel like we've just been getting better every single day. Our mentality, our focus, our energy has just been there on the court. So I'm really impressed with all of that and the whole team. Coach Martin, last question. What's the most important aspect of basketball your team needs to focus on in order to be successful this year? You know, we're just going to have to defend. Um, last year, I didn't feel like our team was a very good defensive team, and we've talked about that type of mentality all year. We want to be a hard-working, defensive-minded team um, that's not afraid just to get down and get dirty. And, you know, if we can do that this year, I think we'll have some success. And that'll do it for Lone Star Conference Media Day. Once again, I'm Tom Norris, along with head women's basketball coach Jason Martins and senior Alexia Torres. Guys, thanks for joining me today, and best of luck this year.